Hey, 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 guys. So, um, I was playing around with this, as you can see. Um, I realised the reason it was dropping is because it matters what direction or what side of this you're on when you place the bore down. So, if you place it from this side, it shoots in this direction and then obviously drops out behind it. So, yeah. It's pretty cool, as you can see. Um, it just kind of keeps going. <laughs> if I put that back in there just keeps going, everything gets chucked in the chest whatever it picks up even if it sort of mines something other than sort of stone and dirt and stuff <laughs> yeah so it's pretty awesome um, well I think anyway yeah so I'll just leave that running, that will use up the um, that will use up the pick and then it will stop which <laughs> is pretty cool and now then uh, there was something I wanted to talk about, I've uh, I've been looking at all the research and bits and pieces and I've put down my Thalmanomonomicon which I shall go and pick up um, and there's some research that we haven't got because you need those knowledge fragments to get it so down here there should be some more bits and pieces including accessories for the golems that you can put on the golems to make them quicker, stronger, cleverer or something, whatever so for the purposes of completeness um, I'm going to have an, a second go at going out f looking for temples um, and like dungeons and bits and pieces to see if I can find some more of these knowledge fragments in chests that are scattered. Um, this time however, I've made sure that the hungry um, chest upstairs is empty and I'm going to take my magic mirror with me. Anytime I get anything useful or interesting, um, I'm going to send it straight back <laughs> so that it's here and I, even if I do die, the only stuff I'm going to lose is this stuff. So I've recrafted another teleportation stone to bring me back to here when I'm done. And yeah, I'm going to go for a wonder. Um, I think I might go... What way are we facing? Yeah, I think I'm going to go west. I'm going to go behind the house. So I'm going to just head in this direction, jump on a boat, and go. And uh, see what I can find. As you can see, i am yet yeah, gotten rid of that, but don't see any point in getting rid of it. Um, so yeah. I will let you guys um, off in terms of suffering watching me going on a journey um, so I will cut back in as and when I've found something interesting so I'll see you guys in a bit hey guys so I have found a, uh, <clears throat> a little underground system what on earth is this? What? What? Cinnabar ore? Nah! Get away! Cinnabar ore? Um, okay, so I don't really know what, where, where Cinnabar ore is. Do you know what, actually, I might grab some of these. Um, what I might do... ...is... ...explore this a bit, and then... ...see if we can find any chests with uh, knowledge fragments in. If we can, awesome. There's more! What is going on here? <laughs> i got this weird feeling that that's from Biomes Plenty. But I haven't, this is the first time I've come across them in all of the hours that I've been playing on this world. Doing this. Loads of it! Okay. Um, okay, before I carry on, I'm going to disappear and go and find out what on earth this Cinnabar Aura is all about. I think. Because that's so cool. Ooh, what have we got here? Yes, of course there's spiders. We know there's spiders. Through there. Let's go take out the spiders. We need chests. Whee. 
More! There's more! Whee! Really not taking this as carefully as I should do. This is why I die, by the way. Because I just jump about. Where did that come from? I was over there. Take that. That is how you shoot, Mr. Skeleton. There's loads of these. Okay. Um, I keep getting distracted. Alright, I'm going to see you guys in a minute. I'm going to just pause off and have a look and find out what this cinnabar ore is. Um, yeah, cool. See you in a sec. Okay, so cinnabar ore uh, can be smelted to obtain quicksilver, which is pretty cool. Uh, so far, the only place I've ever found the quicksilver is in and around um, or underneath silver trees. So that's pretty cool. You learn something new. Uh, I'm surprised, so surprised that I've not come across it before, considering just the sheer amount of mining and stuff that I've done. Um, yeah, it's a bit weird. But anyway, let's carry on exploring this. Da, 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 da. I should really be taking note of where I'm going, otherwise I'm just going to end up going back around in circles, looking at stuff again. Let's grab those. Da. Slowly, slowly. Just want to find chests. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm using stone swords. I just picked up what I had. Hit them with the bow, hit them with the bow, hit them with a the pickaxe. Ugh. Right, let's quickly, whilst we're here, um, let's. Grab one of those, and then let's be smart about it. Let's send these shards back. Let's think. And cinnabar ore back. The rest of the stuff I should keep here because I don't want to fill up the chest at home with rubbish stuff. Cool. More. I mean, I'm not coming across any minecart chests. Maybe I'm spending too much time focusing on other things, I don't know. No, nope, the way is blocked, actually. Let's... Does this go through it anywhere? Does it go through to more mine shaft? Doesn't look like it. Did I go from... I come from this way. Not sure, maybe. Definitely went slow through here already. Getting a boat out there is a bit excessive, isn't it? Right. <laughs> dum dum dum. Tell you what, save you guys watching me doing loads of this. I'll uh, I'll shout you if I find something. See you in a bit. So off in the distance, I think I see. I do see. There we go. What we got? Pile of ashes. Right, let's get rid of those bits in there. String bones, don't want that. Take the tanzanite, take the ruby, take the topaz. And then break it all. Um, yeah. Oh, oh, another one. Now, oh, see, like buses. Where's number three? <gasps> yes! Knowledge fragment. I'll take that pickaxe as well. Right, get rid of you again. Boom, boom, boom. Take that one. Break it. Achievement got ashes. I think I've got that achievement like four times. Let's send these knowledge th that knowledge fragment back. Just because. Uh, where are we? Get out of it. Right. So send those back, those back, those back, those back. Send that back. And boom. We're good. 
Awesome. So it doesn't matter if I die, they'll still be protected. Because they're stored, hopefully, in the hungry chest at home. Hmm? What's this? Did I just come from this way? Don't recognise this bit. No? Okay. All right. See you guys again in a sec. Hey, guys. So, yeah, I, uh, I died. Uh, as expected. Luckily, uh, things are saved. But unfortunately, I mean, I was going for probably for another hour, hour and a half since I mentioned and I got where is it? Did I put them back in there? No. Uh, literally nothing else. Like that one extra f knowledge fragment. Um, I didn't even come across any more cinnabar or anything like that. Uh, which is quite frustrating. Now since I have very few subscribers and these videos aren't getting massive amount of views at the moment I'm not gonna take hours out to keep going out and searching for these knowledge fragments. I'm not going to spend hours and hours and hours and hours trying to find them. I don't I don't have the time. And I think what I'm going to do is... I'm running around for no reason here, just whilst I'm chatting. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is try and sort of gear up. Use what we've got and what, what we know and everything. And some of the cool weapons and armors and enchants and stuff. Get out of it. I'm gonna die again. No, I'm not. Uh, yeah, use what I know to um to try and defeat the Ender Dragon. Actually, I'm gonna leave him. I think. Yeah, try and defeat the Ender Dragon, and then sort of cut that series off. And what I thought I might do is, for a last episode, rather than making that the last episode. I might jump on to um Oh wow. He might actually break it. Oh no he stopped. Uh jump on to creative and actually use um use that to sort of build and showcase the model a little bit. So uh sort of although you've seen lots of it, what I might do is just build an, a new house quickly in creative, not take too long, and really make use of some of the some of the other bits and pieces to sort of do like a show home a bit of a show house of the mod using all the bits and pieces I can chuck in as much as I like then it doesn't matter about how much resources and stuff just to show it off and then that I think I think that'll be cool for um sort of a way to finish off the series by sort of really showing off some of the bits in the mod that I might not have seen during the series uh, let's just get rid of him because he's really annoying There we go. Thank you. Yeah. Um, so what I'm going to do now. Um, I'm going to finish this episode off. In the meantime. You'll notice I've already started getting some bits and pieces ready. So that I can uh, make some um, eye vendors. And I can look for a stronghold. I had actually already got one in place. Um, set up with a teleportation stone. That I'd found in like. Ages and ages and ages ago. Ready for when we wanted to do it. I could just teleport to and we could go. But um. Since obviously I lost a teleportation stone for that, I'm going to need to go find it again. Uh, hopefully though, it will be in the same position as before, where all it needs is one more eye vendor uh, to complete the end portal, and then we can uh, we can get going. Yeah, so I'm going to say goodbye this time, and then uh, I think next episode uh, I might have a look up tactics beforehand, but next episode we're going to go attempt to take out the ender dragon. Yeah, cool. Alright, see you guys later.